Welcome back guys, my name is Skullmember and today we have a simple video but sometimes confusing for others. Today we're going to talk about how do I paint my plane and where do I find the emblems to put on my plane. So it's very easy, this is your starting screen when you get in you choose your plane that you want so we're going to grab the tornado for now and then we look at the top where you see your hangar, your tech tree, depot profile, underneath it says home, service, upgrade and bam there it is, paint shop. When you click on paint shop you'll have a few different things you'll see summer winter desert marine these are your camouflages for where you're going to be so if the map is going to be a winter map that is your going to camo is going to be showing so if you look around we click on the summer one the one that gives apparently plus 10 consumment i don't believe this works because if you check it away it says no additional consumment even if you pay for gold it still says no condition, uh, additional consumer, even though here it gives you plus 10 consumer. So I'm not sure if the consumer works. I normally paint my planes the way I like it. But so when you click on a paint, let's say we're going to go for, yeah, we're going to go for the normal paint that goes on here. And then at the bottom, you get to choose for seven days, which will be allowed, will cost you 11,000 credits or for 30 days, which will cost you 44,000 credits. Or you can pay forever and it will cost you 110 gold. As credits are not really a problem in this game, I'd say go for 30 days and just every 30 days update your color. Also, if you get bored of the color, you can maybe change it around. So now we have a summer map, we have something done. So let's say we have a winter map. I'm gonna say I want the winter paint scheme. There we go. It instantly goes onto credits for 44,000. Very, very nice. Then if we look at desert map, for some reason I read desert. I think I'm hungry. We are going to click the top one. It's also 44,000. And the marine, we're going to click on that one. It will cost me 44,000. If you're not happy with this and you say, hey, but I only want one skin. I don't want all four of them. I just want one skin on every other plane. Then if you just do that, it will only cost you 44,000. So you only have to pay for it once, not multiple times, which is very nice. But if you like it to be... The right paint scheme i'd say go for this and then there you get your paint scheme but don't forget put it back to 30 days because every single time you change something you need to put it back to 30 days or else you're going to pay a lot of gold with it so we're just going to do this for now that's so now we have one for summer we have one for a winter map we have one for the desert map and we have one for the marine map now we're going to look at the nose art so we go to the left bottom we click in it and no sir and now here you will have a variety of things and it depends on what plane you have and what nation of what no sir you get so we can have a little tiny have no clue what uh you can have that one you can have the lady which a lot of people do like i'm not too sure what they tried to make here but you know it's a lady i guess a bit of a chunky lady a lady in blue uh a horse with wings and two X's underneath it. That's probably some kind of bird. And an arrow with wings. Strange. So let's say we'll, we'll grab this one for now. Or we can give it a, a nose job there. Make it sound like it's a surgery with a nose job. I think that should probably be a French flag. I'm not clear what that is. We can make it fully red. So let's, uh, let's take the lady that's laying down. She looks like she's comfy. Then if you go one down, and don't forget, by the way, before I go over it, you can choose here for two, seven days, 30 days, forever. Because we've done for 30 days with credits, it instantly grabs the same thing. Here is the emblem, and the emblem is probably going to be over here somewhere. There you go. You can choose quite a lot on this one. And I mean, just, just way too much. Like, seriously, why do we have so many? I mean, it's a good variety, and people like it. So when you see a little present on the left top here, so I got a present on all these, they won't cost me a bloody thing to put on. These are emblems that were given to maybe Christmas, um, finishing a plane, or all that kind of stuff, or 100 years of Royal Air Force. They don't cost anything, but if you go to any other, you get the same one, and this jumps onto gold for some reason, and I don't know why that does that. So we're going to go to 30 days, and we're going to have a look. You can have your natured flag on it if you want to. Apparently you can have a uh, half smiling, grinding, I don't know, eagle. 
You can be lucky if you find yourself lucky. You can have a very, very beautiful uh, Union Jack on there. I like that one because it's just completely different than everybody else, right? What do we got here? I have no clue because I can't read it. So there is a lot, as you see, we can scroll down. Then there is a lot to do. We got Paper Doll. Some of these things I don't understand. So, you know what? We'll just grab, uh, let's say, the 100 Years uh, Royal Air Force. I like that on there. And it will be on the left hand side as well. If you're wondering what's on the rear, right here, this will be where your clan is. So, if you have a clan like I do, it will show as well. So, whatever picture your clan has, that will show on your plane. Of course, it needs to be approved by Wargaming, so you can't just put anything on there, believe me. So, when you've sorted all this out, you're happy with the color. You're happy with your winter, your desert, your marine, your nose art. You're happy with the lady that's laying down there. You're happy with your emblem. Then you click apply and it will tell you. Applying this exterior for 212,000 credits. If you're, if you're happy with that, you have the credits or the gold or, you know, less if for less days or stuff. You click apply. Now, for 30 days, this is not going to change. It's just going to stay like this. No problem. When the 30 days are over, all the consumers are going to be gone again and you have to rebuy them. Except if you pay them for gold. One thing you should notice is, when you've paid to this plane, and I go to a Mustang, which has nothing on it. Oh, it does have something on it, apparently. Or, yeah, it does, yeah. It's not going to be the same paints, and the paints are not going to be for free. Because every single plane you got... So, no, I don't want to apply that exterior at all, but thank you for asking. Will have his own paints and his own paint schemes, like this one. We're going to grab, let's say, the Russians. Because I do know that some of the Russians... Get a special paint, which is really cool. Have they taken it out? No, there it is. As you can tell, this is the special paint for the Yak 9. It won't be on any of them. So if you want it, it will be in the no additional consumer, and you just have to choose whatever you like. So some planes will have special paints, some planes don't. If we look at one that I for sure know that has a special paint is the IL-40. No, I don't want to do that either. It's good that they ask you when you're doing something. So if you look at the IL-40, this has a special paint as well. There you go. A little paw. And that is the special paint. I decided to buy this one for all forever because I found, you know, I really like it. So I was like, yeah, you know what? I'll pay gold for it and keep it forever. You only pay gold once on this because you've done it four times at the same time. So... That is the best part about painting your plane. You can paint it pretty much the way you like it. If you want it to be all summery, then put all summer on it. If you want all winter, put all winter on it. And that's as easy as painting your plane is going to get. So, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I know it was a short one, but some people don't know how to paint their plane. And now, hopefully, you do. So, thank you for watching, and hopefully, I'll see you all soon. Bye-bye!